Hello everyone. My name is Heng Li Wang from Grand Lab HQST. Glad to meet you virtually at CLRL 2020. Today I will present our recent work, Code AppFlow, Adaptive Modulation Network with Code TJ Strategy for Unsupervised Optical Flow Estimation. This is the presentation outline. First, our motivation, then our code and flow, including the structure of and flow and the code teaching strategy. Finally, experimental results and conclusion. Optical flow describes pixel level correspondence between two ordered images. Therefore, it has been employed in many mobile robot tasks, such as lab and robot navigation. Deep neural networks have presented impressive results for optical flow estimation. These networks are typically designed based on the cost to find framework and cost volumes. And they excel at learning optical estimation from large amounts of data, along with hand labeled ground truth. However, this data labeling process can be extremely time consuming and labor intensive. Recent unsupervised approaches have attracted much attention because their advantage in not requiring ground truth enables them to be easily deployed in real-world applications. However, the performance of unsupervised approaches in occluded regions is often unsatisfactory. We analyze that this performance degradation is caused by three limitations, and thus we propose code and flow to overcome them and I will introduce this table in detail in the following. Uh, this is the structure of our end flow. We also adopt the popular cost to find structure, but add two new module types, FMMs and CMMs to improve the performance. Note that here we only show two parameter levels for simplicity. The first limitation of existing unsupervised approaches is that the cost to find framework is often sensitive to noises in the flow initialization from the preceding parent level. And we develop flow modulation modules, also known as FMMs, in our M flow to address this issue of accumulated errors. Our FMM is based on the assumption of local flow consistency that the neighboring pixels with similar feature maps should have similar optical flows. Thus, in our FMM, we employ the confidence map M and the soft cost volume CS to generate a displacement map D. By warping the original flow estimation based on D, we can replace the low confidence flow estimation with its neighboring high confidence flow estimation. And these two pixels have similar feature maps. The second limitation is that the commonly used cost volumes can contain many outliers due to the ambiguous correspondence in occluded areas. And we developed cost volume modulation modules, also known as CMMs in our M flow to address this issue. Several traditional approaches have formulated this denoising task as a weighted least squares problem. And we realize it by a flexible and efficient sparse point based scheme based on the four ball convolution. The third limitation is that many unsupervised approaches rely on some prior information. For example, the state of the art AR flow first estimates the occluded areas and then uses this prior information to compute the photometric loss and further perform self supervision. However, this information can be inaccurate because a single network can be easily disturbed by outliers when the ground truth is not accessible. Therefore, we propose a code teaching strategy to address this issue. We led to end flows with different initializations, swap their occlusion estimations. This strategy can help them adaptively create the inaccurate occlusion estimations to improve robustness against outliers. In our experiments, we test our code and flow on three popular public benchmarks. We can observe that our code and flow outperforms all other unsupervised approaches while still running in real time. From the demo videos, we can see that our code and flow can present more robust and accurate optical flow estimations. The major contributions of this paper include FMM, CMM, and the code teaching strategy. Moreover, our code and flow achieves the state of the art performance for unsupervised optical flow estimation while still running in real time. Thank you for your attention, and please feel free to send us an email if you have any questions.